I'm Cal Atia, business consultant for a large group of clients at Care First Blue Cross Blue Shield. We're the largest healthcare insurer in the Mid-Atlantic serving 3.4 million people. Our goal is building the future of healthcare. We want to continue to improve quality of care and member experiences, embracing innovation and making healthcare more accessible and affordable. It's why Care First Blue Cross Blue Shield is proud to sponsor the 2020 Small Business Leader of the Year Award for the 10th consecutive year. We're honored to present this outstanding award to Greg Coleman, CEO of Swarkit. I got to know Greg when we graduated from Leadership Montgomery together in 2019. I learned about the great work Swarkit is doing to help people embrace healthy living wherever and however it works best for them. Greg embodies the meaning of an award dedicated to a small business owner whose business has experienced substantial growth and whose leadership is making a positive difference in our business community. On behalf of Care First Blue Cross Blue Shield, please join me in congratulating Greg Coleman, 2020 Small Business Leader of the Year. We believe that in order to make people successful, we need to make, you know, we need to have fitness meet you on your terms, not the other way around. I'm Greg Coleman, CEO and co-founder of Swarkit. So we've made a fitness platform that really just meets you where you are. Uh, you know, if you only have 10 minutes in your house at night to, to get a great workout, then we'll give you that. If you've got an hour, but you need to be quiet because you live in an apartment with people below, we can give you a workout for that. We are a subscription fitness company. Uh, so a customer who wants to work with us, uh, they can either pay us, you know, $9.99 per month or $59.99 per year and have access to our entire platform and everything on it. Uh, we're actually, we've been, we're a very lean, mean team. Uh, you know, we've got uh, nine full-time employees and then we have five contractors. And so we've been really excited about our ability just to kind of keep this company lean and nimble. And it's really helped us to like grow and to pivot quickly and to adapt to market changes uh, without having to be burdened by a whole lot of overhead. Our company has been around since 2010. This is actually our second product. Uh, and we've successfully have just grown it just from being like a cool little niche product to, you know, it's now has over 30 million downloads around the world. I moved here to Montgomery County back in uh, 2004 after I left active duty Air Force. When we were first starting, there was always this tension of, hey, listen, you guys are you guys are a consumer technology company. You need to like, you know, go head out to Silicon Valley. Um, and that was the refrain that we heard a lot early on. But, but we, we resisted that. Um, because listen, we like living here. We like being here. We like this community. Building a business has been the most demanding grind uh, I've ever I've ever gone through professionally. And just to kind of like get acknowledged for what you're doing, just to, hey, we see you. You know, we, we see what you're doing. Uh, it, it, it it's nice. It feels good. I like uh, helping people just to achieve their potential, just to live the best versions of themselves. And if our company can kind of help in that journey, uh, then I feel like my work has been done. I'd like to thank the Montgomery County Chamber of Commerce for the 2020 Small Business Leader of the Year Award. This is an amazing and very unexpected honor, and I'm humbled to have been selected out of all the amazing leaders in this phenomenal county. But just to be clear, I'm accepting this on behalf of our team. We have an amazing team that has been grinding away and crushing it for a long time, and I'm especially proud of how everyone has rallied in the face of the adversity we've all experienced this year. They impress me every day, and I'm so proud of them. The service we provide is particularly relevant today, and our team has made a commitment to help as many people as we can. We have a lot of parents with young children on our team, and as a result, everyone was beyond excited to help students, teachers, and parents stay physically active during the pandemic. We're really proud of the support we've been able to give schools and are extremely touched by the outpouring of gratitude we've received in return from the education community. So thank you, Montgomery County Chamber of Commerce. Thank you to Care First for sponsoring this award. Thank you to educators, and thank you, Swarkit Nation.